I mean, it was funny, man. No, it's not Clay. funny. Come on. Don't ever call me on air like that again to talk business. You understand? I don't care what our ratings are. I will fire your black ass, and I will make sure you never work in another place the rest of your life. You understand? <laughs> Clay, I am the son to your whole media universe. I mean, my ad revenue bring in just about everything you do to leverage your next move. I mean, you know it and I know it. Three mil a year, I walk. It's something that I say all the time on sets and in interviews. My father said, once you find a job that you love, you'll never work another day in your life. So I'm doing what I love and my dream as far as being an actor, a working actor, which is really hard to do in this business. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm successful. So Craig Ross told me that he's known you since you were a teenager. Yeah. <laughs> yes. And he said the same thing you said. He said he's been acting a very long time. I, um... Yeah, well, we're, we're what both... What a great director. No, he's amazing. You oh. guys are so fortunate. And he called me, and, you know, we had a relationship to where, you know, uh, we respect each other's work. Mm -hmm. We've worked with each other, and... Uh, so it was almost like a homecoming for me. I mean, Atlanta, too. So I think that all the people involved, I was just like, this is a no-brainer. So Craig was directing it. Kevin wrote it. And then Twiggy Bird uh, was casting it. I was like, I gotta, I gotta be a part of this. If you try to renege on those options, I will see to it personally that they have to will you into the radio booth. Here's one of those nice little special rooms. You see, that's what they do for people in wheelchairs. They don't have to change the name of the show to DJ Broken Legs, No Legs, Can't Walk, Can't Talk Morning Show. Now, do I make myself clear? The comparison is, is kind of like to The Godfather. Now, Michael loved his family, and although he had Fredo done away with, Maybe he didn't love his family, maybe he just loved... Well, I love my family, but you know, but Anthony, he better get his stuff together. Are you out of your mind? They will kill you! What I'll do it again, Ma, I don't care who you are! You won't! Let, let him kill me! Let him kill me! Let him kill me! Let him kill me! Stop it! Damn. Anthony, nobody in this family is gonna let anybody talk to you that way, not ever. Yeah. Now you go fix it, understand? Yeah. See how serious he is, but you do whatever you need to do to protect your brother. What we have here is an amazing team that's becoming a family and uh, yes. you know and I think it's on the right network and what I love about the fact that it's on TV one and it being a big project for you guys I think it's something to where we can kind of get some people's attention right now TV's king and if you have the content yes. that's all that matters and I think content you guys have it rules. absolutely that, that's what it is I think that that I'm very spiritual, mm -hmm. and I believe that God puts people in the, the places that they're supposed to be yes, at the times yep. that they're supposed to be there. The people who said no, I think <laughs> they couldn't have said yes because they were not destined to be part of it. They the wasn't family. ready. <laughs> I'm just saying. You just say it. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> just say but I really do believe that. I sure. believe that the cast, I mean, you all look as if you're Penny's children. Mm -hmm. Jackie Jones, who's the matriarch. Yes. You all look like you belong to her. And she said that when she came in, she said, I cannot believe that every character that you all cast looked like my family members, yeah. my real family members. You can tell we're siblings. Yes. We have we have this uh, type, this family camaraderie. When you have that chemistry, it shows on the screen. And yes. if we believe it, then they out there will believe it. <laughs>